That's not, you want to say something? You want to say something, statue? You want to do something? Well, okay, you know, where'd you go? Hey everyone, welcome back to Flames Plays, and today we are playing Woodsy. Now, this is a game that was made for the Ludum Jer uh, Ludum Dare 41. Ooh, right click is to turn off our flashlight. What we got at Godin. Wasn't hipster enough. At Malhu. Garlic overdose. Okay, so these are just these are just uh little references. So it looks like we are trapped in the woods. Let's check out this door. We can go inside. It's locked. Okay, it's still locked. We're gonna click on that as many times as we need to to make sure that we can get we can't get in there at all. There's another door. Over that way. Oh hello. Hi, who are you? Hi, you have a mushroom on your head. Froggy is hungry. I am too. There's lots of fish in the lake. Can you swim in there and get some for us? Um, I mean, maybe? I got a fish. Okay. Alright, alright, I can go. F man, we are like the best fisher in the freaking world, man. Woo, look at that. All them fishies. Been gotted. Alright, let's see what Sarah says now. Thank you, mister. You should take some to Martin, too. Martin lives in the huts. Uh, he's usually hungry. Okay. Um, no sprint button. We can jump slightly, which is good. Where is Martin? Is that? I just see something red over there. Oh, there's a little guy. All right, let's check out this door first. Then we'll check out the little guy because there's no ladies anything to the right. We've got. It's locked. Nothing. The factory is locked. Closing time. And no one is working overtime. All right, little kitty cat? Little guy? Meow, meow. Strange purring. Okay. All right. Weird, uh, weird kitty. Well, we can, we can, you know, all cats are lovable. As long as you don't vomit when you're sitting on my chest, that's cool. I'll, I'll still appreciate you, kitty. And even if you do, I'll forgive you eventually. Ah, uh, this is the hut that Martin lives at. Okay. Martin is nowhere to be found. Alrighty. Let's see. Martin hiding around here? Oh. Um, okay. I have questions. And concerns. Oh! Oh. Hi, Martin. Oh, you brought me fish? Thank you. Oh, can you bring that gift to Peter for his birthday? He's probably in his cave just down the path. Okay. Uh, you seem kind of busy right now, so we'll we'll let you be, and we'll just go drop off uh, Peter's birthday gift. Let's see. So he's probably in the woods. Oh wait, what's that? What is that? Oh, I thought that was a person, like a tall figure. Uh, instead, it, I mean, it looks like it's a tall figure. It's also got some. Oh, never mind. I thought it was writing. It's just little little placards where you could put writing. Uh, so he's down the path. Question is, what path? So I'm starting to wonder if it's on the other side of the lake, maybe. Because there is, it looks like there's stuff on the other side. And we can go back over here. And... And... No. Not over here. I gotta say, this is well, really well made. I can't get stuck. That's actually promising. Too many games uh, let me get stuck really easily. Oh, cave. Right there. Oh my god. I'm an idiot. Had I not noticed that. Okay. Hi, kitty. Hey, little guy. Little guy with your rock face. Strange purring. Alright, that's cool. You do you, buddy. You do you, fuzzy wumps. I don't know why you call it a little guy. I'm gonna call you fuzzy wumps. Alright, Peter. What's up, man? Got a delivery from Martin for you? Uh, it looks like you're a little, little preoccupied being a stump and all that. Okay. Cool. Wait, is that we good? All right. Cool. We're good. Oh Jesus fucking Christ! Oh my God, Peter, you're a dick. Thank you. Happy birthday to me. Happy birthday to me. Peter, you are such a sack of crap, man. Oh my God. All right. So. 
Was that statue always there? Was that sat was that statue always there? What are you doing? What are you doing? You follow me? You got something you wanna say something? You wanna say something, statue? You wanna do something? Well, okay, you where'd you go? Alright, alright, you are teleporting around. Alright, we're just gonna we're gonna keep on trucking. We got the factory key. That statue ain't gonna stop us. No sorry. Uh alright, where you are in the factory. I don't quite know why, but we are. Oh, hey. Jeez. Thomas. Hello. Welcome to my lab, friend. I've been working on my latest experiment. A new body for me. This one's gotten too old. What's that? Newton is missing his legs? Oh, I took them. Was that Martin or Newton? I suppose you can have them back. You can always find another pair. Hee hee hee. Hee hee hee. Hee hee hee. Alrighty. Oh, boy. It looks like you're having a having a swell time here with your science and all that. So you have fun there. We are just going to we're going to leave. It's just that's all we're going to do. We're going to just we'll just book it out. So it said Newton, but I think it means Martin. I don't see anyone named Newton at all in this game. Uh, Martin was over this way. Peter, you sack of crap. I can't believe it. This game's not even scary. It's actually, it is creepy, I will say. But it's not scary. Except for Peter. And when the statue teleported, that was pretty cool. I like that. I don't know if that was timed or if it was just because I was in its face for too long, but that's still pretty sweet. So these games were made, uh, I believe, within 48 hours for the uh, Ludum Dare. Uh, probably in this cave just down the path. Okay, so that's that is Martin. We're looking for Newton. I don't know where Newton is. We got some bones for Newton. Who is Newton? Sir Isaac Newton. Died like it lived, loved by all. Excuse me, Sarah, could you help me out and tell me where Newton is? Huh. That didn't really help too much. It's that little guy. Wait, well, Newton lost his legs. So, I would assume maybe something low to the ground? Presumably? I don't think Newton is this kitty. Strange per, yep. I was going to say, that kid, kitty's name is Little Guy. Or Mr. Fuzzy Wums. But not not Newton. No siree. Oh, you just keep walking in circles. Peter, could you help me out? You're probably just going to say, Happy birthday to me, aren't you? Yep. Yes, you are. Oh, great. Thank you for making that strange noise. That's not going to haunt my dreams at all. We are looking for a guy named Newton. Is this Newton? Nope, not that's not Newton. It's not around here. I mean, there's this random hut. Still don't know what that's all for. We have the we had the factory key, but that doesn't help us with opening up our cabin. Our ca the cabin's still locked. Yep. Cabin's still locked. Let's take a look at the air. Maybe Newton is one of these guys. Newton is for sure. Oh, God! Fuck you, Newton. No way, where'd you find them? Thomas again? That weirdo. Oh, while well, I was laying around here, I found your keys. Found your keys. Thank you. Newton, two skeins to live. Yep. Newton was a skeleton. God fucking damn you, Newton. I literally feel a little nauseous now because of that. Uh, I think I need to eat more food or something today. And now we're going to sleep. Why do we leave the door open? That sounds like a terrible idea to do. Especially in a world full of so many monsters. Leaving a door open, not a good idea. Oh, hi. 
Oh, okay. It's just a very nice thank you for playing. Awesome. So I really enjoyed this, actually. It was kind of cute. Had its had its good moments. A lot of it was more... I mean, if, they, if you had just told me that Newton was in the graveyard, I would have been... Okay, cool. I'll just hop, out, hop over to the graveyard. So, Thomas, you're a bit of a dick. Peter, major dick. Hey, there's the uh, woodsy symbol. Or the woodsy logo again. Yeah, so if we had just read beforehand while we were reading these things, that this says... Wow, I could have gotten scared a lot earlier, too. Holy crap. Have you, buddy, have you seen anything? It's got this button. We're going. Can you finally let me know. Okay. So, yeah, the game could have been a lot worse in terms of scariness, but that was actually pretty cool. Um, it, it had good moments. And even the statue, which I don't understand what the statue is about, but still, it was cool. Um, had, had me a little jumpy. Music was good. Sound design good. Overall, liked it. If you want to give it a try yourself, the link's in the description down below. Make sure you are subscribed so you get updates for release new content or go live while live streaming. And if you like the video, leave a thumbs up, leave a comment down below. Always appreciate it. Have a great day. Remember to burn bright. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.